we have the end gear. We're gonna open it. It's seven. This. Yeah. Where my uh, drink plug is, and over where is the where is the filler plug? Oh, that's over here. Sure, I need some paper. Ready. The drain plug. Oh, back here. And also a washer. Okay, washer. Washer, a uh, bolt, bedoel ik. Op. Die zijn all the same length. So, you don't have to worry. Why worry? Mark Noffler's wrote a song about it. Okay. Okay guys, we're gonna take this one off. That's easy. Take a, I think you call it a mallet. Just tap it gently and then <laughs> over here. Yep, there he comes. As I always say, I never use a brute force. Brute force is the last option. Oh yeah, that's already. Here we got it. Okay. Filthy stuff over here. And let's see how this seal is. We put that out of the way. So, like this, it stays clean. We're gonna warm up this, and then we can tap out that big bearing that's in here. Really loose fitting. 
shot, it doesn't need much. Of course, my fluke. Ta da! So we can see where we're at. Now we're at 20. Wow! <laughs> It's aluminium, so it goes very quick. Already at 75 Celsius. Yeah, I think. Yeah, it's more than 80. Okay. Yeah. Let's tap the boy out. Up. See. Wow. Easy as hell. And now, guys, we have these shims. There is in here only one. And it's still hot. Well, very hot. We also tap out the seal. Mm, not sure. Better place it over there before it drops. <laughs> okay. Now that seal. We're gonna renew it anyway. So, take one of those, Hop. okay, wow, gonna let it cool down, we're gonna get this tapered bearing off. Is that easy? Yes, with the right tools. This is my, uh, yeah, we call it a, a mesh puller. Not sure how you call it. We get this around underneath the bearing. Then, now we're gonna heat up the uh, bearing. I have my heat gun. And of course I got my thermometer. bit difficult to see as it is shiny stuff.
Ow! Uh, really hot already! Ah. Oh. Now, then we gonna. Oh, even this one is already warm. Huh? Ow. Okay. Yes. Then I found this. Gonna put on top of this one. Then, oops, we screw on this one. Okay, then this one. Okay, then yes, it's a good hold. This one. Okay, now let's see my light. Yes. Now we gonna get it out. With the hammer. Yes. Let's see. Yep. There it comes. Well. Yep. Hop. See. This one. But then, guys. Okay. There is this washer and I'm gonna mark the upper side. As there is, I'm gonna show you in a moment. This is also some sort of a shin. So, see, scratched it a bit. Okay. Now, I'm gonna show you. And if you look careful, you see there is a, yeah, call it a bevel. And that needs to be like this. And what I did, even kijken where you can see it, hopefully, I gave it a bit of a mark. So I know now how to put it in. So, was that easy? Yeah, absolute. Then, hop. Oh, it's still hot. This is the uh, old bearing. Okay, and now we're gonna take this one off. Ta da! Now guys, <clears throat> to get this bearing off, I had to uh, modify with my angle grinder. These, uh, these were, watch, 
these were the original and I with my angle grinder I got this off this a tiny bit thinner smaller so now see it fits underneath the bearing yes Okay, oh, guys. Then Yes, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> it took a bit of persuasion. <laughs> yeah, this you heat this up too, that's the problem. But Now guys, first I'm gonna give this one a good clean because it's filthy. Okay. Yes. Okay. That's good. Then we're gonna do the other side. No, no. Okay. So this. That all grease out. Where is my wonderful, wonderful toilet paper? Oh, fell down. Okay, now guys, the next thing I'm gonna do is get this 
old. Yeah. Sticky stuff. Not sure. I can even call it grease. Of course, with a bit of petrol. <laughs> gonna do the side on the bike too. That's quickly done. Hmm, nice. Let's see then to make sure no thing falls in up to those cleaned bearings. This one over here too. Okay. Oh, like this. So wait a minute. There has over here is the uh, drain plug. Okay. This is good. We're gonna put a clean rack over it. So, hop. And now nothing can fall in. Then, and we have this one to clean. See? Okay. okay. Now, this one. It's good. Put it away like this. Nothing can fall in. Wow. 30. Whoa. Oh, mechanic. No. Uh. Yes, D and D. Of course, my favorite petrol. <laughs> wow. Mm.
filthy thing with a lot of Loctite. Something over it stays nice and clean. Okay. This needs to be absolute perfect spotless. Underneath here was the washer that I marked. Remember? And I had marked it on the upper side. Yep, that is my mark. Guys, this one, eh? I'm gonna put in the fridge to make it shrink. So let's see, for fun, how how much it shrinks. Hopefully, that's a good. Let's see, guys. We're gonna have fun. This one was outside, and the temperature is now 15.2 degrees and I'm gonna measure this and I'm gonna put it in the fridge so it shrinks and I'm curious how much it shrinks over here I have my uh, digital micrometer so set it to zero yes Yes. Wait a minute over there. Twenty five point oh oh seven. Twenty five oh oh seven. I'm going to write that down. The temperature was fifteen point two C. And I measured 25.007. So that's 25 seven thousandths of a mil. Okay.